Now, a lot of you may wonder how these guys don't get burnt out on traveling and staying in hotel rooms. Well, Steve Elkington just joined the Champions Tour this year and is rolling with the motto, go big or go home. Steve Elkington here has been gracious enough to invite us into this big rig. They call it the uh, the big show. And Steve, just tell us a little bit about this, where it came from and how this all started. I started this project for my debut this year on the Champions Tour and I decided that uh, if I'm going to go and play this whole tour, I'm going to do something different. And I had an opportunity when uh, Will Smith had this rig. He used it for a recording studio. It's a 1,200 square foot double decker. We gutted it and then we just said, you know what, we're going to do this whole golfy thing in here and make it as luxurious as possible. When I first was going to take this over, I knew I was going to have a golf room. I had a little putting green. Nobody has a putting green. Being a golfer, you gotta have a, you have a lot of gear, right? So I got all my shoes and some whiskey. So if you have a good round or a bad round, you might have to have a, a tip there when you come in off the golf clubs, etc. You know all the stuff you need for golf. But really, what this room was all about was to be able to practice putting anytime you wanted to. The nice thing about the big show is it's so big, right? This way, mm -hmm. we're 10 feet away from Craig, who who's a true manager, runs the big show, runs work for all the all the actors and all the all the. Uh, famous bands all over, all over the world, so lucky to have Craig running the big show for me. One of my sponsors is Viking, so we build a whole Viking kitchen and, you know, they put all the, all the appliances in there. One of the things that a lot of people don't realize that we have in here is full gas, right? So that's cool. Nobody has gas, so. One of the parts of our jobs that I think a lot of the tour players will say that's the worst part, is, and that is, you know, being isolated in one little spot, you can't do anything. Mm -hmm. This is a whole different deal. You know. So it's like home, home away from home? This is pretty homey. What do you think? Oh, it's, uh, it's big. I wanted to do it big. You know, one of the things about being in an RV is small, right? But we did full, full shower, big, big golf, uh, you know, deluge shower. Wow. All of the courses there, big vanity. Washer and dryer, which is really a luxury on the road. So this goes to the master suite. Oh, okay. Okay. What do you think? Nice. We're going up. Yeah. Whoa! So you've seen these, right? Check it out. There we go. So this turns around. So you can watch, you can watch, you can sit here and read, which I do in the mornings a lot. PGA champion. 24 karat. Woo, Steve Elkington. You see that PGA Championship champion 1995. 24 karat gold, my friend, and I'm going to try to put this thing gonna right into the cup. Oh. Is there a little lip in this thing? Let me see. Let me I see. don't know. Let me see. Let me see if there's any break. He's gonna he's gonna show us how it works. No break. You just don't hit it good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not yeah. hitting it good yet. This is my hole in one for all the marbles. Maybe. Boom! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, what you don't know about that is it actually took me six tries to get that putt in. That is a very cool rig too, and of course it was Will Smith and Vin Diesel's. Wow. And once they gutted it all out, they ended up spending 400000 just in renovations. And he's got a three-year lease on it, so it'll be interesting to see if he holds on to it or who the next person will be that gets it. Maybe you. Maybe me. And to your, I mean, in your defense, it probably wasn't level, right? It was probably tilted. That's why I, you I think it was missing. a little tilted, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thanks, Lauren.